Welcome to another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to set up the QSM flashcard plugin. And today we are using a disposable WordPress environment. If you'd like to set up your own, check out this service called InstaWP. It allows you to instantly launch a WordPress environment. It's extremely flexible and has amazing features. So check out their website at instawp.io. Okay, so let's set up our add-on. From your dashboard, click QSM. So if you have not installed Quiz and Survey Master, there is a link in the description that will show you how to get started. So from this dashboard, click Extend QSM with Pro Add-ons. All right, so here we see three pricing plans to purchase add-ons as a group. But if we scroll down, we can see individual add-ons. So click Browse All Add-ons to search for the Flashcards add-on. Okay, so here it is on the right. Click flashcards. Okay, so on this page on the right hand side, this is where you can select the number of sites for which you want to purchase this plugin. Once you're done, click add to cart. And once this page opens, all you need to do is follow the checkout process. And once you're done, you will receive your license key as well as a link to download your add on. All right, so let's go ahead and set this up. Let's go back to our dashboard. So just close this page. Okay. So hover over plugins, then click add new, then click upload plugin. So you can either select the file from your computer, or you can simply drag and drop from your download location. Click install now, then click activate plugin. All right, so we have installed our add-on. All we need to do is go ahead and set it up. So hover over QSM on the left, then click add-on settings, then click settings on the right. And here you need to enter your add-on license key. Once you're done, click save changes. Okay, so now you are ready to set up your flashcards. On the left-hand side, scroll down and click flashcards. All right, so let's create our flashcard. Click add new. Let's give our card a name. Let's call it general questions. Click create. All right, so we have created a flashcard. You see we have our short code over here. All we need to do now is edit this. So click edit. Okay, so next click add flashcard. Okay, so we have the front and the back of the flashcard, and this can be customized to our specifications. So let's change this text. Let's say, what is the speed of an eye blink? Okay, so we can put the answer to this question on the back side. So the average blink lasts about one tenth of a second. So I'm going to type this as the answer. All right, so you can always use this toolbar at the top to customize your flashcard. You can add some media by clicking this button. Let's make our front text bold and let's do the same for the back and let's add an image to the front. So I'm going to select this eye image and you can always customize this image by simply clicking on it. So once you are happy with the content of your flashcards, click save flashcards. All right, so let's go back. All right, so let's copy our short code. Let's add a new post. You need to add a title, let's say general questions. At the bottom, if we click this block, then click the plus icon, click short code. Here we can paste our short code. All right, so once you're done, click publish, then publish again, view post. All right, so this is our flashcard. So we have our question, what is the speed of an eye blink? And if we click this flashcard, it flips over and we have our answer. The average blink lasts about one tenth of a second. So if you had multiple flashcards, you would be able to click next to go to the next flashcard, but we only have one. All right, so I really hope this helped. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. See you guys in the next one.